Oh, no. What's she doing here? Um, you know what? Maybe you're all right. Let's not rush into this. Uh, maybe you need a bit more time to think about it. <laughs> What's gone into you? Huh? Nothing. Now, come on, this way. Hey, we'll come back another day. <gasps> Blodwin. Where have I heard that name before? You haven't, OK? No, let's... Oh, if she's the same Blodwin who fell asleep on you the other night, she's got a big wake-up call coming. Oh, no, Mum, please don't. Oh, you must be Mrs Boy. Oh, and you must be very well rested. Oh. Hi. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Arthur. Blodwin. Well, I mean, what a coincidence. I didn't know that you worked here. Um... Yes, you did. I, I, I mentioned it lots the other night. You asked if you could legally sue your local supermarket for suggesting a barbecue chicken has eight servings. Oh, yeah. yeah. To be fair, no one has ever ordered a one-eighth chicken and chips. You know? It's always quarters. I understand you're here to sign some documents. I certainly am. But more importantly, my boy deserves a second chance. Oh. oh, you should have seen him when he first worked the cash register at our restaurant. Oh, mashing his fingers across those buttons like a giant playing a miniature keyboard. We, we might come back another day. <laughs> but eventually, he got better at it. And by the time he was at university, he could barely look at the register and cha-ching! Okay, yes. Come on, Mum. Come on. <laughs> I am... I'm sorry. She is unwell. Why? 